Thank you for watching. Thank you for your support. And if you have not subscribed to this channel yet, please click that subscribe button and the notification bell so you'll know when I upload a video. Good morning, good morning, how are you? I am doing well and I hope that you are too. I am braiding and banding my hair in order to shampoo it this morning. I have been locked or had sister locks for over two and a half years. My sister locks were established March 4th 2019 I've never had slippage I've had just a tad bit of bunching in one of my locks I've not had issues with my locks since I had them established I considered uh, not braiding and banding my hair. I did consider that and I tried it at least once and I did not like the feeling of I'll say the weight of the water on my hair without it being braided and banded. I just took out the braid from the back because it was too tight and I needed to make that adjustment. I'm gonna go ahead and braid the braid in the front and then I'm going to get in the shower and shampoo my hair. One of the things I wanna tell you about shampooing, and this just came to mind because of what I've seen now that I am working behind the chair as well, is that when you are shampooing your hair and in the shower, make sure that you pay close attention to what's going on in the bag. When you are rinsing your hair and the water is going through your hair, you usually stand in the shower and the water goes in this direction. So when the water is going in that direction, whatever is in your hair on your scalp it is flowing down so you may want to pay close attention to this area and these areas to make sure that everything is rinsed out in those areas as well and it doesn't get stuck there so rinse 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 and rinse now I'm braiding and banding my hair for security reasons. <laughs> it's so that I can feel secure while I am shampooing my hair. Pretty much I'm treating my locks like babies. You know, they're long enough that I can put in big plaits. So I put in the big plaits and then I band the ends just I like I would have done when they were newly established. A mother has a baby. The baby is crying. The baby has been fed. The baby has di had a diaper change you know that your baby is just fine but your baby is crying so you pick them up you may even swaddle them in their blanket just to make them feel secure i am the baby because i need to feel secure for my own security to make sure that my locks are okay and I feel comfortable while I'm shampooing my hair in the shower. And that's all that I'm doing. I'm doing what I need to do for my sense of security so that I'll feel comfortable 
in knowing that my hair is okay. I found it necessary to come back after I shampooed my hair. I tied my hair with a scarf to dry it. And I wanted you to know that as I was shampooing my hair, I decided to do a check of the back. And so what I did was I took my fingers and just scratched for my scalp very lightly. And as I was scratching it and I removed it, I could see that there was some buildup that was on my scalp. And so in order to make sure that I took care of that, I shampooed this area again. And I concentrated back here where I felt it. it. As I was shampooing it, I could feel the, the smoothness of whatever was there. And I worked until I felt secure that I had shampooed it enough, I massaged my scalp enough to clear away whatever buildup I had in the back. And then I rinsed my hair and I rinsed my hair and I rinsed and I rinsed and I rinsed. I was really rinsing to remove everything from the scalp. And I just felt it necessary to come back and tell you that. Have a good day. This is a sister who loves her locks. I love my friends. I love my family. I love my followers and my subscribers. But I especially love God because God is so good. He is so good. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. Have a great day.